Where's the fucking shark movies at? Oh my god, shark movies! Shark movies! There's a shark movie! Oh, there's another shark movie! Oh, another one! Another one! Another one! Shark movie! 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 Ah! Oh, the shark! The shark! Shark! Ah! Oh my god, so many shark movies! So many shark movies! Look at all these shark movies! Look at all these fucking shark movies! Ah! Ah! Shark movies! Shark movies! There's enough shark movies to fill the ocean. If I had as many brain cells as there are shark movies, I'd be a fucking genius. Wait, I am a genius because I'm about to put together the best fucking list ever of the best of the worst shark movies ever made. That's right, we're not looking for quality here. We're talking about the ones that are so bad they're good. You know, I have one simple request, and that is to have sharks with freaking laser beams attached to their heads. Steven Spielberg popularized the idea to kill a shark with jaws, and man, did everybody copy it. Oh, shut up, smile, stupid fish. Welcome to the endangered species, lefty bastard. But when Spielberg was making jaws, he was essentially making a B movie, except he turned it into a mainstream Academy Award winning blockbuster. He missed the point. He made it too good. Audiences used to be satisfied with cheap special effects and poor acting. Now, everything's gotta be all high quality and shit. Sharks don't look fake. So let's take a look at all the shark movies that brought the genre back to its low class roots. There's so many, I had to be very selective. So I narrowed it down to 40. So let's dive in. It's Cinemassacre's top 40 shitty shark movies. Holy <laughs> shark! Number 40. Jaws 2. Just when you thought it was safe to go back in the water, Roy Scheider's gotta deal with that smiling son of a bitch all over again. What I love about the sequel is that even after the shark gets its face blown off, it comes back for more. Like it's Freddy Krueger or something. Number 39. Jaws 3. Yeah, you see what I'm doing here. This time the shark goes crazy at SeaWorld. It's a deadly new attraction with Jaws 3. <laughs> what really made the sequel stand out, it was in 3D. Yeah! The highlight is an explosion of shark guts. Number 38. Jaws 4, The Revenge. It's no mystery anymore. The shark is deliberately stalking the Brody family and is literally seeking revenge for its exploding death by Chief Brody in the original Jaws. I know it's probably supposed to be from the same shark family, but I like to think it's the same shark that somehow resurrected itself. I mean, the shark here actually follows Brody's widow from Massachusetts to the Bahamas, and it roars. <laughs>